Let us have a look at advantages of IoT. The first advantage is efficient resource utilization. Now, efficient resource utilization means if we know the functionality and the way how each device works, we can definitely increase resource utilization as well as monitor natural resources. So, if devices are going to work in a particular pattern, we can ask the devices to work in a uh, in different different environments also. The second one, minimum human effort. As the devices of IoT interact and communicate it with each other and do a lot of tasks by itself, so humans do not have to interact, do not have to intervene in between, and the efforts are minimized. The third point, third point is save time. As it reduces human effort, then it is going to save the human time. Time is the primary factor in automation which can be saved through IoT platform. So we can save a lot of time because of because of IoT because things are working automatically now. They are automated. The next advantage is enhanced data collection. Now IoT can collect data from environment like weather, sound, pollution, etc. This data can be used to take decisions. So based on the data, then IoT is going to work by its own decisions. They are going to use their own knowledge and work further. Next, improve security. IoT-based security systems can make home or office environment secure. So the uh, IoT helps us to keep our things secure. When we are using IoT, many a time there are face recognizing systems. So only if the face is recognized, then that particular device can open. So this is how the security can be improved. If there is a breach in security, then it is going to send a message to the concerned person. The last advantage is anytime, anywhere, any device. So using IoT, since it is connected to internet, it is Wi-Fi enabled, you can use it anytime, anywhere, and, and any device which is having the basic features. Okay, so these are the six advantages of IoT. Let us have a look at disadvantages also. There are two disadvantages of IoT. The first one is privacy. Now when we are uh, using IoT, lot of the information of a person is exposed and since a personal information is exposed, there can be breach in the security. Some people can get in that personal information and corrupt our system. So without even active participation of the user, IoT system provides for substantial personal data in maximum detail which can be used by some persons for ill practices. The next disadvantage is complexity. The designing, developing, maintaining and enabling the large technology to IoT system is very complicated. It is not an easy task to uh, build these IoT systems. There has to be an integration of a lot of things which is quite complex. So these are the two disadvantages of 